you guys. I'm starting with my hair already washed. I'm using UD7 half wig and also a pack of braiding hair. I'm starting off by parting my hair from ear to ear. Now, I am not good at parting at all. I just try to make sure that you can see some scalp. It's good thing is you don't really have to worry about the part. You don't have to have a perfect part. Um, only because the half wig would be applied and you can kind of cover that up. Now, if you're good at parting, go ahead and do your thing. Make it perfect. But it's not really important. Now, this style did take about 30 minutes to do. The longest part was the braids. And I only said that because I did get like 72 inch hair. So I had the braid to the end. Also, I never did like feed in braids. I literally just used to braid in just to the scalp um, or like my own hair, not adding hair. So... That's why the braids are small. If you want thicker braids, you know, the more hair. If you are good at the feed-ins, go ahead and do it. But me, which is very simple uh, with the two braids. So I'm going to let you guys go ahead and watch me. Um, and I will come back in the video. So y'all, when I braid, I don't do too much. I'm literally doing simple braiding. I do not get fancy with it. So like when I braid, I just be like really hoping for the best, <laughs> like for real. So if you just know how to do some braiding, go ahead and do it. I only add hair when it's needed. Like I said, I'm not good at feeding. I wanted to look like they were like feeding braids um, and I wanted to have it look perfect. But I was literally just the edge control helped me out to make sure that my hair stayed together and it all was getting braided. But that's it. I'm just braiding down.
So now the braids are done, I am going to be going uh, applying the half wig. I'm only going to be using a little bit of leave out. So the rest of my hair will be back in a ponytail. Now I will advise to just maybe braid it down so you can have it flat in the back. But I'm just going to go ahead and use the ponytail. I'm also going to be crimping that leave out. So I do have a plug-in crimper that I'll be using. I'll show it later. But I thought I was recording when I was crimping my hair, but I wasn't. So when I go back, you will see that it's already crimped. But you see how much I crimped just that little bit of leave out and kind of like blend it with the hair. Also, this half wig is a drawstring, so I will prefer to get a drawstring. That way, when you comb the hair in, you're able to make it as tight just to make it fit. Also, it's just better. I like the half wigs with the drawstrings, but that blood I'm doing in the back is just adjusting it. And then you can just apply hairpins to get, you know, to pin down anything, you know, extra. If you wanted to cover that part, you can use, you can do hairpins to cover that up too. you guys this is the finished look i hope you guys enjoyed this video if so make sure you go ahead and give me a thumbs up if you are new to my channel make sure you go ahead and subscribe 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 thank you guys for watching i will see you guys on the next video bye